I wish I could say my hair looks like this because I'm a new mom, but um, I was like this before I was even a mom, so let's just ignore the hair. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It has been so long since I've actually done a video. I do have a baby now. She is two months old today. And I hope that I'll be able to make more videos moving forward with her because she's just so cute and so fun. I'm finally showing you guys my office. I have been trying to remodel this office space for the longest. This office space was disgusting and it was just, it's like really messed up too. It's kind of like crooked and it's just weird. It's like an add-on to the house. A little backstory: my husband and I bought a foreclosure home. Guys, it was a disaster. There was rat poop everywhere, dog hair everywhere. The carpets used to be, I'm sure, like white or like cream color. They were almost black. It was just disgusting. We bought it in March 2020, and at that time that we bought it, when we signed the papers, was the same week that we were told that we might not go back to school at the school that we worked at because of the pandemic. And so we didn't know how we were gonna pay this house. We didn't know what to do. It wasn't livable. How are we gonna afford to like remodel it? But God is good and God is faithful and he provided all along the way and we're here still in this home and so we are slowly remodeling it, we're slowly painting it um, and it's come a long way, it's not finished but it's come a long way. You're going to see, it. I'm going to show you a before and after uh, clip at the end of this video but in here it was just filled with desks, desks were dirty, The there was rat poop in like the drawers, guys we found teeth in one of the drawers teeth I don't know if it's human teeth I don't know if it's dog teeth I don't know what the heck but there was teeth in the drawers I really wanted this office space because I was working from home distance learning so I really wanted a space that I could be focused at I could work at and that it'd be cute and fun so it's not finished in here completely I want to finish the floor if you, you you'll kind of see in the video that the floor is just painted white and that's because I'm wanting to order this stick and peel floor tile things um, and I have to order them and I really want to do that in here so that's the only thing that's not done the floor isn't done and my window situation is a little messed up but I think for some people they want an office space that is really calm and neutral and peaceful to focus on but or focus in but for me I love a colorful space I feel most creative in a colorful space and I'm just really excited about my office I love my office it might be one of my favorite rooms it might be my favorite room in the house actually no my baby's nursery is my favorite room in the house but this is definitely my second favorite this makeover is really budget friendly honestly guys the most expensive stuff in here other than just like my computer and that stuff is the paint the paint is more expensive to buy but um, I actually was able to do this room with leftover paint from other parts of our house and the colorful paints that I have like the yellows and the peaches all that stuff they were relatively cheap I also got a lot of colorful paints in the clearance section at different stores because sometimes people bring in their colors that they didn't like it wasn't the right color and so they sell them really really cheap and so that's where I I buy a lot of my paint Another thing that was a little bit more pricey was the carpet. It's like this like gray shag carpet. I got it at Walmart for like 60 bucks um, and that was pretty expensive. But I'm sure that there are cheaper options out there. And lastly, the other thing that was more expensive was my couch. The couch was actually relatively cheap if you ask me. It was $100 on the Facebook marketplace. But we, it was our first couch we had in this house. But it was white and white gets dirty. Plus we have a dog and it was just too small for the space that we had so we ended up trying to get rid of it and then finally we just never got rid of it and I just bought a couch cover for it online it's like this velvet soft couch cover and it worked perfectly and I love it and it ended up breaking out that we didn't get rid of it my desk was free I found it like on the side of the road someone put it in front of their house and had like a free sign so I took it painted it um, my bookshelf as well it was on someone's driveway and they just put a free sign and I picked it up. I brought it home and I painted it so that was a lot cheaper than 
buying a desk or buying a bookshelf online or somewhere else. So yeah, the, my office isn't perfect. There's still things that I would like to work on, like I said, especially the floor. I hope that you enjoy this really quick transformation. It's not a long video. I just was really excited to show you guys already. It's been in the works for the longest time and I'm glad I'm finally done. Anyway, stay tuned, subscribe to my channel, like this video. I hope to be putting up my baby's nursery tour soon. It's pretty colorful in there as well. I think you're gonna see that throughout my house. My theme is just very colorful. So stay tuned if you'd like to see that nursery tour video. Let me know in the comments below what was your favorite part of this transformation. Once again, thank you for watching and I hope that you have a great day. Bye! Oh, oh, oh.